is up, bells? Welcome back to the channel, you guys. Welcome back to another vloggity, vloggity, vlog. It is currently 8 o'clock in the morning. I want to say it's like 8 20 now. Um, and it's like a few days later after the last vlog that I gave you guys. I'm currently still up and I haven't really been to sleep yet since last night because I've been having toothaches, y'all. I've been struggling with my toothache on this side, on my left side. So today is actually my dentist appointment and I'm so glad that I'm about to be going to the dentist and I'm just hoping everything goes smooth, calm, and collective to where they can just say, you know what, we're going to go ahead and pull that tooth out. I'm really hoping that they're gonna just do that. So with that being said, you guys are gonna come along with me today to the dentist. Hopefully, I probably won't be able to record you guys because I'm going by myself. So I probably won't have nobody to hold the camera for me to record. So I guess I'm just gonna have to update you guys once I get out of the dentist to let you know what they have said to me and stuff like that. And hopefully they'll be able to pull this tube today. If they can pull it today, you probably won't hear from me until the next day. You probably won't hear from your girl until tomorrow or something like that. Um, when it comes down to talking, because I'm going to have to get this too full. Well, luckily, too, I do have some videos that's already pre-recorded um, for me to post for my Sims content. So... If I do get my tooth pulled today, it won't be a delay on me posting videos because I won't. I'll have videos that's already pre-recorded for y'all to watch until I heal up. So I'm just hoping that everything goes smooth today, and I'm definitely hoping that they're able to just get this tooth out today because it's been causing me a lot of pains. The medicine hasn't even really been working for real for y'all, and I'm just so over it. I'm just so ready to just get this over with and just be done with it. And I've been procrastinating on calling a dentist because I didn't know about my insurance for a while. But now that I know about my insurance, I'm like, I'm so glad that I'm able to get into a dentist and hopefully can get it out today. Like, I'm just so over it. <laughs> the pain just has to go away. And I know for a fact it's my wisdom teeth. I know that it's my wisdom teeth because I've struggled with that with my right side before, before they pulled that side out. And ever since they got this one out, which was a different dentist, I've been fine. That's all I need. I just need y'all to pull this, please. Because I can't get nothing done without it being pulled. So I'm going to lay down for a little bit. Hopefully I can get some sleep. I'm about to take some medicine. Um, and then I'm going to see you guys when I get back up. I'm going to probably get up about, I want to say maybe 10, 45, 11, as long as somebody calls my phone to interrupt me while I'm trying to sleep. I should have time to go ahead and get myself together so I can get to my appointment on time. My appointment is not until 2 p.m. and I already filled out my paperwork. So once I go in there, hopefully I'm just going straight to the back and they can just go ahead and examine my mouth and tell me what's going on and what it is that I need to get done. So I'll see y'all in a little bit. Your girl's kind of tired. I'm going to try to take a little nap until it's time to go. y'all so it's later in the day and i'm just kind of like getting myself together to kind of wind down um so i actually got um an upcoming appointment that i have to go to um wednesday back with them so i can uh get a fill-in so just a little update for y'all. I have um I have a cavity. Then he also wanted to basically remove all three of my wisdom teeth. He was saying that all right, y'all. Okay. So he was saying that he wanted to remove all three of my wisdom teeth just because if he takes these two out, top and bottom. The one at the bottom on this side probably will cause me pain as well. So it's no point to just have them. And of course, you got to get your wisdom teeth pulled out. So I'm going to get them pulled. I got to find me a oral surgeon because the one that 
they are referring me to, my insurance doesn't cover it. So I'm gonna try to call tomorrow to see if I can call my insurance and see if I can find me an oral surgeon. And hopefully things go well with that. Um, he, oh, they also prescribed me this um, mouthwash, which I haven't used it yet, but it says Swish Mouthwash um, undulated, and what? Undiluted for 30 seconds and spit out use after breakfast and before bed. So I guess I'm gonna take this before I actually go to sleep. Um, it doesn't say that I can't eat. But I'm pretty sure, like, um, eat first and then do this, of course. So I'm going to take this tonight before I fall asleep, rinse my mouth out. Um, and then I also got amoxicillin, which is an antibiotic. And then um, I got me some ibuprofen. The Tylenol that they prescribe me, certain pharmacies don't sell it. Um, at the moment, they were like, oh, we've been out of stock with this for several months, two months. So, literally, I have to um, go to my local grocery store to see if my pharmacy store has it. Because I called the one that was kind of close to my house, too, which is a CVS. They don't have it. And that was one of the ones that said they didn't have it within several months. They have not had it. So, I'm going to go to my safe way and hopefully their pharmacy has it for me to pres get that prescribed um we'll get it filled and then that will sum up for the medicine part but excuse me um so far since i've been taking the antibiotic and the ibuprofen i haven't had no problems my mouth has been fine y'all my mouth has been very very fine um, of course, I can. I know that it still pains and aches and stuff right in this area. So I know like for a fact, okay, I still got to get it taken out. Like I can't just keep pushing it off. So tomorrow I'm going to be on grind time and just try to get it done as soon as possible. Because your girl needs to get this together. Because literally me having two pains, that's not helping me out. Along with trying to get things done around the house or even dealing with the kids too because it gives me like migraines and also I've been having a hard time sleeping so I'm losing sleep on top of that so I would definitely need to go ahead and get these teeth pulled out for real so I guess it can be very serious and going to see a dental surgeon that definitely means I'm probably going to be put to sleep other than them just pulling it like giving me the shot numb in my mouth pulling it out like that I gotta go actually to a surgeon so I'm just hoping and praying that I can find one that's gonna take my insurance and I don't have to come out of pocket for it. Which if I get the the one they refer me to, um, I think they said it'll be like three forty, three hundred and forty dollars probably is what I'm looking at. So I'm hoping I can find one. But if anything, whew, whew. Excuse me, y'all. I'm tired. If anything, I'm just going to have to go ahead and probably pay that fee. Which I really don't want to do that because why well, do that when you have insurance? Make it make sense, you know. But y'all, yeah, I'm tired. Your girl's sleepy. I literally need to get some rest, honestly. I took a nap when I first got home. I was dozing off. I did take a nap and I woke up. I think I took a nap, it was like around, I want to say close to 5, and I woke up, it was 7.30. So I've been up ever since, it's currently now 11, I believe, it's like 11.30, so your girl's still tired. Um, fed the kids, got them situated and stuff like that. LA is actually sick, y'all, again, the weather has been changing and it has been farking up everything like literally farking up everything because she was just perfectly fine and now my baby's sick and you can smell the sickness on her like you can smell that sickness i don't know if y'all know what i'm talking about but when you go into like a hospital you can smell that sickness you can smell the fever the cold that's in my baby and it's horrible horrible but i've been lysoling the house up trying to disinfect too 
tomorrow I'm definitely going to be disinfecting because for sure, for sure, <sighs> Messiah and Nova both wasn't feeling well either. So it's just like, dang, like, everybody getting sick. And I'm not trying to get sick. I really don't want to get sick because I'm no, I have to take care of them at the end of the day. So, yeah, but that's about it, y'all. I need to get some sleep. I'm tired. Your girl is exhausted. So you guys probably won't see this vlog until the next day, which will be Thursday. Today's Wednesday, but yeah. Yeah, today's Wednesday, but yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this little mini vlog. If y'all did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Join the Sabel gang, 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 if you haven't by now. We love to have you guys over here on this side. So subscribe, join the family, y'all. Let's chat up in the comment section down below. And yeah, um, I'm trying to pick up like some videos to do for y'all. So y'all give me some suggestions. Like, what do y'all like? What do y'all like to see? I'm very, I'm very basic, y'all. I don't really do too much. I don't go out. I don't do none of that. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just in the house. But, um, yeah, I mean, unless somebody invites me out, then I'll probably go out and stuff like that. But I don't really do too much, so I just be chilling. But yeah, yeah, I need to take my allergy medicine too because I felt like my face is starting to break out and all that. So I'm about to rinse my mouth up with that. Woo. Yeah, it's real. It's bedtime. I love y'all. Thanks for tuning in with your girl. And I'm going to catch y'all in the next video. Bye, y'all.